Today's video is another project pan update and it is the Snow White and Seven Pans project. Um, so this project is in collaboration with the Fantastic Ladies, they have a Facebook group, I've said it a million times if you're new, um, you should definitely head over to them, check them out. And if you love getting use out of your products, um, then I definitely recommend heading over there and seeing what they've got going on. Um, so yeah, this project lasts from the 12th of March to the 12th of September. I did miss my update for it in May. Yeah, in May, because um, I just had so much going on, I just didn't get the chance to get around to filming it. So here I am now, um, we're in June, I'm filming it. Um, and yeah, I, I have to be honest, there's not an awful lot of usage. Um, but yeah, so where is, so I've got them all in, little baggies like this with the name of the project on so I don't get confused because I have so many projects going on at the moment. So yeah, for this project um, you have the seven dwarves and you pick seven products that correlate with the seven dwarves. So the first product I have is a dopey product which is a product you feel silly buying. Now I chose this um, Revolution Skull highlighter in the shade Lover's Wrath. Now the reason I picked this is because I bought it specifically for the packaging. <laughs> Nothing else, just packaging. Um, I think I've used it once or twice since my last update in April, so I really haven't had an awful lot of use out of it, so there's not much to show here. Uh, next up is a Happy product, which is a favourite product, and I picked the Soph X highlighter palette. Um, I love this palette, it is one of my favourites. Um, at the moment I am using a few other highlighters, but I do tend to dip into this one every now and again, and I do actually have it on the inner corners of my eyes today. Um, but yeah, this one, there isn't a particular goal on it. Uh, for this one it's to use it up, I'm doubtful, but here we are. Um, but for this one it's just to get some more use out of it, um, because I do actually have a backup of this palette because I love it that much. Uh, next up is a Doc product, which is a product that makes you feel better. Now I chose the Wonder Kiss Essential Lip Scrub um, by Wonder 2. I have used it quite a bit, there is now a dent on it, um, but I know there's a lot of product in here and I could probably use it a lot more, I just haven't reached for it. Uh, next up is a product you have a love-hate relationship with, uh, so a grumpy product, and I picked the Clearasil Ultra Rapid Action Pads. They're empty. I used them all. I didn't have loads, um, but I did have some. Oh, the smell. Um, and yeah, they are empty, they are gone, so I do have one empties this month. That is about the most progress in this project pan update that you're going to see. But yes, I have finished it, I'm happy, it's gone. We are down to seven, no, six. Six dwarves and six products left. Uh, next up is a Sneezy product, which is a product that smells nice. I chose the Benefit Professional Pearl Primer. Um, I have used this a few times, there's probably only about this much left in it. Um, I do really like it, I just don't like the texture on my fingers, um, but I do like the primer and I probably would buy it full size, I just don't like the texture of it on my fingers. So yeah, there's that one. Uh, the next one is a bashful product, which is a blusher, blush coloured product or a product that is out of your comfort zone. Now I originally chose a pixie blush, but when I used it, it just didn't feel right on my, like for my skin tone. I really didn't like it. It just wasn't something I knew I was going to be able to spend seven months trying to project pan. So I switched it to the Blushing Hearts uh, Triple Baked Blusher. Um, in Peachy Pink Kisses. This is what it looks like. It is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. I haven't used it at all for the last month and I know that's really bad but I've got so many other ones that I'm using up um, so I do need to get more onto this. Um, but yeah, I do love the triple baked um, blushes and highlighters and things. I think they're fabulous. So yeah, there's that. And then the next, well, the last product I have is a sleepy product, which is a comfort product, a staple, or one you're confident panning. Now I chose the Soap and Glory Bright and Pearly Radiance Boosting Cocktail. 
this is how much I have left. It Every time you pump it, the thingy moves up and squishes the pearls and then obviously you get quite a shimmery skin. Um, I haven't been putting anything on my skin at the moment. I have no foundation on or anything. It is literally just eye makeup because I had a reaction to an eye mask I used. So again, no progress on this one, but I have used it three or four times since my last update in April. So I'm happy with that. But yeah, they are my updates for this month. So I have one empty, um, which I'm really happy with and I'm glad it's gone. Um, I am hoping to have made a fair dent in this by my next update. To have at least picked this up would be nice for my next update. This one I'm really not holding my breath for. Um, I feel like it's going to be one that I will probably use a lot more when the weather's a lot better. It's been absolutely pouring it down today. So I don't feel like being all shimmery and sparkly. But there's that one. These two I just want to get some use out of, so I'm not worried about hitting pan or any particular goal on them. I just want to be able to use them a little bit more than I am. And this one I'm hoping will be gone by my next update. So yeah, we are down to six products. My grumpy product is leaving. Um, that's everything for my Snow White and the Seven pa Pans update. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and you're enjoying all the projects I'm doing. Um, as I've said in a couple of videos now, there are some new ones coming. Hang on till the end of June and you will know all about them. That's everything from me. Take care and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye!